Here we are at Uni New South Wales at the Michael Crouch Innovation Centre where there is always a better way. And it's in that spirit that we've run the ANZ Data Science Hackathon and brought together an array of amazing partners. Our participants are from Uni New South Wales and they join us from a number of different disciplines. We've teamed them up with some incredible mentors from IBM, Thomson Reuters and GitHub. We're about to witness something intense. Let's go take a look. And this weekend is absolutely fantastic, is that we're talking about, you know, the agri business. We picked up on it a few years ago um, around uh, what follows the mining boom, the dining boom, the changing demographics in Asia. I think it's a great opportunity to bring uh, young people and, um, and, and, and more experienced people together in, in trying to solve these type of problems. We're trying to find what really matters when uh, predicting prices. If we can predict the price for tomorrow, what does this mean for Australia's exports? Basically just uh, researching the amount of arable land that each country has. Essentially predict the impact of natural disasters on the production of grain. What we're aiming to do to use this data is to hopefully provide, I guess, a plan for ANZ data analysts and traders. So basically we spent this morning practicing our pitch and perfecting our product so it works how we expect it to. And yeah, we've been getting lots of really good help from all these mentors who've come in, looked at what we've done and really shown us what kind of impact we can have with our idea. I guess the important thing for me for, the, for this hackathon and, and the whole event, so it's an extended hackathon. Um, obviously the main, you know, the main component of it is the solutioning and what we can get out of it. And the bigger picture I think is really exciting is, is what we're contributing to the whole future of work piece. Employability is an issue in Australia for even uh, students in IT. Um, I think giving them practical experience in trying to solve real world problems, working together with the industry will increase their, not only their employability, but especially you know, their passion for the subjects. I think the students have changed. They want to do more things, they want to be involved. At the same time, the university has a, a new strategy for 2025 because we want to foster more innovation. We want to make them think like innovators. IBM has been involved from the very beginning, um, not just in providing the technology, such as the Bluemix developer platform, some of our analytics. As well as trying to develop talent um, and skills in the marketplace that ANZ Bank can take advantage of. Some really smart students with some really great ideas. Um, the bit for us is obviously the ideas that will come out of today, which is, which is fantastic, but what are we doing next and how are we broadening that out? This stuff is, is in ANZ's DNA. We've been looking at it for 100 and 80 years facilitating uh, commercial trade and ag out of Australia. But some of the, it's refreshing to see the new ideas coming through from these students. I find it uh, fascinating, it's just a whole lot of new ideas that we wouldn't have otherwise come up with ourselves.